probably no um no captions for this, right? I think that's what I have actually. I think I have the same specs. I got a thirty two bit one. <laughs> Still a black screen while the other one is loaded. Oh shit, so much faster. <laughs> this is a joke. Oh my god, look at the difference. Look at that, there's zero lag with all of these people hitting that thing. Whoa. Unbelievable. Dude, is this the fucking dream? Is this the thing we've been waiting for for 17 years now? Or 15? Is this game finally going to be playable? Dude, look at how much stuff there's going on. And there's not a single frame loss. Th you know what this kind of feels like? That if you're like in a test server, and there's only 10 people on the whole server at the same time, and you're all doing this together, but there's no one else in the entire game, and it kind of makes sense that this is the normal amount of lag that you would have, which is zero. But look how they're, they're not dropping a single frame. Like, it's not lagging for a single pixel. Holy shit. That is so crazy. Imagine this game actually being playable. God damn. We were watching. Um, 64 bit client for MapleStory that's in testing right now in KMS. Because everything else has moved over to 64 bit, I think, since 2010? And MapleStory is still like, or since 2008 or something? I don't know. And everything else is still in 32 uh, MapleStory is still in 32 bit. First they got to was 30 FPS with 100 people spamming shit. I don't think I even get to 30 FPS with no one spamming. Nice. So now it's, now it's slightly lagging. I think this is what you would get if you had 10 people instead of 100 people. But even then, this is still better than, than Ursus was when you could see 18 people's damage, right? Look at how much there's going on. It's still, it's still not really lagging. Like it's, I think it's normal for any game to have some kind of issues rendering all of this, right? But there's still... Like, look at the rockets. 
There's a screen shaking. They're not really lagging either. They're like throwing everything they have at this. <laughs> and it's not even and it's not even that bad. I get more lag in my in my hard bus runs with six people, honestly. Show. Well, when your players stress test, they're gonna stress test, and I don't think it like disconnected or lagged people at all. Or the one who, the guy who was recording it, had like a supreme ultra direct connection or something. Yeah, if that lagged, that would be normal. Like any game would lag when, because that's not really intended, right? And you'll never really have situations where there are so many people going so fucking ham on, on something in a town map, right? That also probably wouldn't be designed to handle it, right? Like a boss map w would be designed to be able to handle that a bit more. Where's the Shamu? True. Next one cheaps out on the AWS servers. Yeah, you think that even if the client was this stable, that it wouldn't be able to perform this well because next one would be on AWS. What I just hope is that more people play the game if it gets more stable and people come back and actually keep playing it so that Nexon can go for more expensive servers and go for an upgrade. I know Heterochrome, I have, um, I have a progression session in like 20 minutes. to remove second pendant from set effect no second pendant has already been removed from the set effect for the past uh, two weeks we've already lost our set effect they're adding the option to finally switch one of your pendants out for the belt that's what they're adding It's only game becomes stable, everyone managed. Yeah, maybe maybe p people can actually, uh, well, not solo, but people can actually Ursus load in properly, you know. Uh, some people have not been able to do any boss, like, pa uh, past CRA. <laughs> yeah, the problem will be the parts that are non-KMS will have to be specifically made for GMS and for the other servers in the 64-bit 